Hello, and welcome to the People's Mental Stimulus Update. Today's topics are going to be cryptocurrencies and the cops at fault for mistaking their gun for a taser. And I have two videos explaining that, actually from two cops themselves, explaining the whole difference between the pistol and the taser, saying that the, basically saying that this female cop that pulled the taser out knew what she was doing. But first, let's talk about cryptocurrency. As people probably know, cryptocurrency is basically on the rise. I mean, if you notice, Bitcoin is at like $63,000 a piece. And don't be wrong, I would love to have some cryptocurrency. That would be awesome, you know. But I don't. I actually have two different types of crypto cryptocurrencies. I have Ethercoin Classic, which is actually doing me pretty good. I mean, I've just, I've just started investing like I think last month. And on the two cryptocurrencies I already currently have, I've already made make a three hundred dollar profit off of, but that's not that bad. But um, I also invest in other stocks and I watch them. And basically, uh, the, if if you if you're a good investor, so I'm still a learner investor basically. But if you're a good investor, you'll be able to tell when to sell and when to buy. I actually use a, the app called Robinhood. In fact, I actually am going to put a link in the video as well as in my description. So in case my viewer Tommy out there would like to get a free stock from Robinhood, unless he's not in, currently part of Robinhood. So I mean, unless he's currently a part of Robinhood, he can actually get a free stock on me. All he has to do is click on the link. Oh, and that goes for any viewer as well. You just have to click on the link that's in my description or in probably the description. And it'll open up Robinhood app for you. And you sign up. You don't have to invest anything. And it'll give you a free stock. I open, I invested, well, I opened up my account last year with Robinhood. And they gave me a free stock of GME, which is GameStop. Well, at the point, at that point, it gave it to me. It was $3.11. Didn't cost me a cent, like I said. And I just barely started re reopening my app yet. Uh, like last said so last month, I started reinvesting the cryptocurrency, and I noticed that my GME was went up to one hundred and fifty nine dollars, and now I have one share. So I basically made one hundred and fifty nine dollar profit. It didn't cost me nothing. So if you're not using Robinhood, please click the link in my description and uh, get started up and get your free stock and start make let's start making money together. That goes for every viewer that sees this, including. My friend Tommy and my other friend uh, Freddie, if he ever if he ever pops back up on here, I think he sort of dropped off a bit. But hopefully, if he pops back on and sees this one, which is very important. But like I said, cryptocurrencies are are going up. I've invested in Dogecoin as well as Ethercoin Classic, and both have so far made me more than twice the amount of money I put into them, which is good. And I also invest in the cannabis market. Unfortunately, I noticed a lot of them are actually costing me money because of this losing. I mean, if they start losing more like dollars here and dollars there, you might as well get rid of them, right? I mean, I have I'm keeping one stock currently that allows me to, uh, that currently has lost me 31 cents. That's it. If it's, it gets $2 or more, then I'm going to scrap it, of course. Anyway, good, a good stock to invest into if you wish to invest. It would be AIV, which is an apartment investment uh, management company. And I've noticed how they're, they haven't cost me anything yet. They've actually made me a few pennies here, a few pennies basically, yeah, about 14 cents, to tell you the truth. And it's a good stock to go for. If you guys like me to do more information on the cryptocurrency and stock market, please let me know. I'll be more happy to do that for you. Now onto the topic of the cop that said she accidentally grabbed her taser, sorry, her pistol instead of her taser. Well, I have two videos here from actual cops that will help you understand how sort of hard it is to make the difference of opinion between your pistol and your taser. So if you stick with me, I'll be right, I will pop these two videos up and I'll be right back. Thank you. Dominant, not so dominant. Huge weight difference, guys. I don't understand how we can mistake a taser for a gun or a gun for a taser. If you're in the heat of the moment and you do something like that, 
you shouldn't be doing this job because nobody likes a bad cop more than a good cop. I can tell you that straight up. I'm not going to put my life on the line to try and, you know, fix your stupidity and, and deal with, you know, restoring the peace with my public that I serve just because of your stupid actions. It makes no sense. 99% of our job is communication. You don't got to be quick to pull out a gun or a taser on somebody and think everybody's a threat. Not everybody's a threat. Try talking to them. Get to know them people. So the palm of my hand. You need All right, so real quick for the smart asses that keep telling me that it was a mistake. This is my taser, department issue. First thing feature, notice the short handle. Short handle. Look at that. My regular firearm comes all the way down to here, to the palm of my hand, to the bottom of the palm of my hand. This doesn't even really reach it that much, right? Another thing is when she pulled it out, right? And she said, taser, taser, taser. Notice something. There's no light, right? When you charge it, then you have your red dot and your green dot, okay? That's a taser, okay? Notice the difference. So even if she pulled it out and she mistaken, like, how? Look, how? How? <laughs> how? How? If she was really had a taser in hand, she wouldn't have been able to tase him because it wasn't on. All right, so real quick for the smart asses that keep telling me that it was. And as you saw, it is actually quite hard to make the, to differentiate the, um, well, it's easy to differentiate the pistol and the taser because the, the handle of the taser is smaller than the pistol, and also the taser weighs less than the pistol does. And as you saw from these two cops, they basically say that this female cop did not make a mistake because there's no way you can make a mistake that big, especially when your pistol weighs a whole lot more than your taser does. But until next time, you guys have a wonderful evening. And I will broadcast again to you next time I have more information. And like I said, if you wish to me to talk to you more about stocks, let me know and I will be more happy to comply with you. Until next time, you have a wonderful evening. Bye. I got this feeling inside my bones. You win the club, just to party. I'm there, I get paid a fee. It's right and I and I won't be long till I hit the guns, fly, hit the guns, fly. I'm living out in